Okay, this is all the bits for the ram pump that we're going to try and make here. Okay, we're going to try and get the uh, ram pump working today. So Doug's on his way down with the pipe and his measuring stick. And there she is. We're hoping to get free water from our ram pump. So uh, there's the inflow pipe. So we're going to try and lower the level down the pump end and get a better. Right, here we go. This is the water ru running at the end. We're not sure it's enough flow. So uh, we've got to lower this uh, pump. Here. Okay, we had to relocate the pump to get a little bit more full. But as you can see, the valve is operating and we have some water coming out. Not very much at the moment though. We need to create more back pressure. Okay, we have the inlet coming down to the pump, and the valve's fully open, and the feed pipe is heading on up the hill. So in a minute I'll go up there and see if there's anything coming out the other end. This is Eco Energy at its best. Okay, we're right up by our water tank now, so we're 10 lengths, so it's 200 feet of pipe up from the river, probably about a 40 foot climb, and that trickle is a gallon every six minutes. It doesn't look like it's very much, but that over a 24 hour period would be, be, uh, be about 150 gallons, more than a day's use easily. All free and very eco. Here we are at the beautiful mermaid's pool, the source of our fresh, clean drinking water. We're heading down to check the pump before we close it down and get it ready for permanent installation. So here we are back down at the pump. She's been running now for about seven hours, just chugging away, pumping that free energy water up to our tank. Well, she will be once it's permanently installed. Can't get more eco than that, that's what I say.